Hey guys, William Shat here. Uh, I've got a special video for you on uh, Tier 5 ship upgrades. Uh, I wanted to see what consoles would upgrade. Um, another thing that I, I found out when playing around uh, with some of the ships is that our blue Universal Councils have now been upgraded to Epic Universal Councils, um, which is kind of neat. doesn't really do anything for us. But uh, we are going to upgrade the Scimitar right now. And in doing so, we receive an extra Engineering Council. Uh, the next ship we'll look at uh, will be the Falchion Dreadnought. As you can see, we have four Engineering Councils, three Science, and three Tactical Councils. Uh, when we upgrade the the Falchion, we end up receiving, and it skipped there, an extra Tactical Council. Uh, the next ship we look at is the Tall War, which is the science variant of the, um, the Warbird. And when we upgrade this ship, we get an extra Engineering Council. Um, I know many of you probably did the Rise and Summer event, uh, and you're probably wondering what council we end up getting here, and when we upgrade this one, something very odd happens, actually. We get two engineering councils. Um, I think that's a possible bug. Uh, if I had to guess, I'd say we'd be getting one engineering council. Uh, at the moment, um, it's saying that we have 12... Uh, 12 council slots. Uh, the most I've seen on any of the upgrades uh, has been 11. So now going over to another Ryzen ship, we have uh, the Luxury Cruiser. Um, when we upgraded this ship, uh, we actually... were able to get a extra... Tactical Council. Um, notice some of the some of the stats earlier um, has upgraded some of the hull on some of these ships, some of them not. Uh, it's hard to say what is going to be. Uh, if you look back earlier, I think the hull was around forty three thousand. Now it went up to forty seven. Um, next ship, our next set of ships are going to be the Odyssey class ships. Um, at the moment, we are looking at 42,000 hull, and with all the consoles we have here on the science cruiser, we actually get an engineering council, which is kind of weird for the science cruiser. But uh, the hull doesn't increase. Um, the hull did increase for the rising cruiser. Uh, when we upgrade the tactical cruiser, uh, I think many, many, many people here are going to be very happy with this upgrade. As again, you notice the, the epic councils. Uh, we get an extra tactical council. Um, that's going to be very beneficial for some people that have said that the tactical cruiser has not been as powerful as they'd like it to be. Uh, now with the operations cruiser, uh, when we upgrade that ship, we end up getting another tactical council. So that'll help with a lot of folks who want to tank and also be able to do a little bit extra damage. Uh, I happen to have this, uh, the science destroyer on my one ship and when we upgrade this ship we get an extra engineering council. So that'll add a little bit more survivability who, for those who are flying the science destroyer and this one is also a free upgrade uh, for everyone out there on uh, onto the Tholian recluse which uh, I'm sure some people have it's probably not a ton of people but with the hull it's at 43 500 
Uh, with its upgrade, we gain an extra tactical, tactical council, so that'll be really nice for some people. And as you see, the hull does go up from 43,000 to 50,000. So that one's getting a bump. I'm not sure if uh, some of this stuff is subject to change. Um, we will see as time goes by. Um, our next ship, um, or set of ships, uh, ends up being uh, the, the fleet uh, Cashin Atrox carrier and the re regular Cashin Atrox carrier. Um, I, I just happened to have both of these still in my inventory and I wanted to see what would happen when we upgraded uh, the Cation. Uh With this upgrade, something odd happens. It kind of just disappears. Uh, in addition to that, they haven't added the upgrade ability for uh, the fleet Atrox carrier. Um, now if you go to the website it says that the upgrade that the, the fleet version is upgradable. So it's hard to say what council we, we will be getting. If I had to guess I would say it would be another tactical. Uh, I can't say with any certainty though. Um, and we will see where that ends up uh, landing. Um, in addition, uh, we also have the heavy escort carrier, and when we go ahead and upgrade this ship, we gain an extra tactical council. So this is going to be an even more dangerous ship. Alright folks, uh, thanks for watching. Um, do me a favor, leave me a comment below, tell me what you thought of the video, and uh, thanks for watching, we'll see you back here next time.